let's recreate this advertisement design for Nescaf. All right, it is Nescaf. Without further ado, let's jump right into the video. My name is Niamuda and welcome to my YouTube channel. If you are new, welcome. If you are a returning subscriber, you are also welcome. Please subscribe and hit the like button. Without any wasting of time, I'm going to do two things. Number one, we're going to bring go over here and get a background. The background, I'm going to blow the background. To blow background, usually I come over to this website here called just go to search and look for type in blur images online you will see this background this website called lunapic.com slash blur click on it and it will take you to an interface where you'll be hangs to upload right upload the design that you want to blow right to then you blow the background and then you save it and take it to wherever you want to use so this is the website so if you want to this is, this is the background i'm going to be using so i brought it in here and then i put it at this place here and then i blurred it right and then you click on apply when you click on apply you it will load right it will load and then you will be asked to download it you will see this part that says save your save your device save to your device you see it here at the bottom here you see it save to your device so you click on it once and then it will be saved to your device all right having said that we're going to go back, back to pixel lab i'm going to bring you that background i talked to you about i told you about so this, this is the background here um this is it there's a blood background you can see i'm going to scratch it like this and i'll put it here stretch it like this and i'll put it here okay all right then i'm going to come over here and i'll bring this guy and i will bring it to the front all right and i would cut this guy out leaving only this one so i'll put it here like this i will just go over here and i will just reduce the opacity small like this and then after you know to be moving up and down i'm just going to go over here then i'll lock it and i'll lock the background too now the next thing you want to do is to bring in this guy here which is the logo send it to the front like this and put it right there all right okay now and in, in the original design it's going to be just white like this okay now bring it again because we're going to be using it right here but this time around is going to be the black fashion so remove the color all right good now the next thing you want to do is to bring in this guy here okay put it here and adjust it like this okay so in order for you to get the position very well maybe you will need to use the original design to see it but if not you can do this then position it here like this all right cool okay then come over here no need to import anything i've imported all of them already so this guy is the next guy here this is going to be there all right okay then we have um this guy yeah where are you now um, okay i didn't see it so i'm gonna go over here and import it which is this guy here right it's going to be right here okay so we'll come over here increase this and then bring this to the front and bring this to the front also then move this down here yeah. all right so it's taking shape okay so let's go over here and get the original design now you're bringing the original design so that you can see um just the positioning so i'm just going to go over here and i'll drag here like this and i'll send it i'll send this guy to the front right so so i can move this here and i'll drag it here like this all right then i'll send this to the front all right so i put this here and i drag this here all right so come over here do this um increase this sorry not that increase this then do this all right then i bring this guy to the front also 
All right, so this guy is not bad here. Okay. All right. See what you use it. Yeah. All right. Let me send the original design to the front like this. All right. Send. So we'll, we'll just bring our text. All right. So this guy here is um, not this. This is going to be here. All right. Just fix it there like this. Then you centralize it. Okay. Then let's take this guy out. So this is what we have. Something like this, right? Then we can bring this text now. This other text. This guy is going to be here. Now we're going to pick a color that is all right. Um all right. You notice that this part of the design, the top part is is basically white. Let me show you something. Let's pick this guy to the front. Mm, let's go over here. All right. If you want to get the exact color, then you can just pick it from the original design. It is a dark shade of. Um... All right. So that is it. So I can just fix it here. Then centralize it. All right. Then do the same thing here. All right. Cool. Cool. Very cool. So this is going to come to the front. And this is going to come to the front like this. All right. Then you notice that at the bottom there is going to be shadow. So let's get something that I'm going to be using for the shadow. So um, this guy, this guy, this guy, this guy. Let's reduce it. Okay. All right, I still want to bring this. Well, let's bring this to the front. Okay, so let's try to adjust it. All right, so let's get something to work with. All right, so this, this guy is what we're going to use as a shadow. So I'm just going to go over here and I'll put it black like this. All right, so I would click here. All right, so I'll click here. All right, so I'll just put it there. Now, this is the old design, so let's take it out so that we'll work on the real one. So I'll do this. All right, so put it there like that, okay? Then copy it and try to put this here also. All right, copy it also and try to rotate this and put it here. Now, by doing that, you have shown that this guy is real. All right, so you see it now. All right, so apart from that, I still want to bring one of this and do it like this, do it like this, and I'm going to use make it white now, and I'll put it around this part. Yeah. Okay, and I'll still copy. Copy and put it around here. Yeah. Copy and put it around here. Yeah. Um, okay, here. Yeah. Alright, so that being done, I'm just going to lock it like this. And I'll try to bring these guys again back to their position the way they were before. And I'll bring this guy, no, the text. That is this to the front, this, this and this now if you notice that the corner here is looking like it is um too whitish so it's not giving me the kind of um result i want so i'm going to go back to this place here and i would remove this part and there's something there i'm removing it not there all right so so that that part will be showing very very well so this is what we have now all right so you need to go and edit it now that app to make it look um more real so i'm saving it now i'm taking it to pixart we are here import the design that you have just saved all right this design then go to image that is 
app image then look for this guy now as i want to show you it's not going to be here so let me look for it all right so you can get this anywhere just go to your internet your google just type in lens flare you will see it all right so or you check the description all right just do this increase this and put it there mm, i want to reduce it i put it here okay i put it in there have you seen that now all right so that is that um, I think that is all. We can go ahead and save it. All right, save. Then save. Now I'm going over to another app to do just one more thing, and that is going to be Snapseed. Snapseed right here. I'm going to click on the plus. I'm going to add the last design I just saved, which is this guy here. So I'm just going to go and click pop, click pop, and see the result. Right. Then go to tool, sharpen it. All right, so um, that's not all. Go to looks. All right, it's, it's a little bit too bright, so let's come over here. Reduce this. All right, then we can also check brightness, contrast of the brightness. All right, so you just go ahead and edit it here. Touch it one, once or two, and then you're good to go. Click on export and click on save. My name is Niamuda. I hope you got value from this video. Please like and share and subscribe. Thank you.